Um, so I've always been hugely passionate about helping other people. Um, growing up, I had quite a bit of a difficult experience when I was 15, when I was unfortunately the victim of a sexual assault. And through that, it was a very difficult period of my life. But I think with that, it, it sort of ins- it, it gave me some sort of like inspiration um, to keep going with my work. So the NSPCC reached out to me and they offered me to apply to be a national ambassador of their organization. And they do incredible work with championing the voices of young people and getting their voices heard and forming campaigns and policies all designed to help young people. So when they reached out to me, um, I accepted and I went with that and I had incredible opportunities to get involved with their campaigns. And when I started doing it, I realized, you know, I really enjoy this. And um, starting that from quite a young age, it really helped me, um, you know, find my voice again and be in a position where I can help other people. So after doing that for several years, I started getting involved with other organizations as well, um, including Childland, but also the National Children's Bureau, the British Youth Council. I was a member of UK Youth Parliament for Medway, uh, representing young people in my local community. Um, And through that, my actions were recognized um, by the Diana Award with the Diana Legacy. Had the incredible opportunity to meet Prince William as well. Um, So yeah, the whole experience has been so surreal. Was was it just him or was he with um, Kate as well? No, it was just him in that day and Prince Harry met with the international winners. So it was both of them sort of involved. What was he like? Oh, he's lovely to talk to. Um, he really took, because there was um, 10 of us in the room and he really took time to talk to each of us and get to know the kind of work we did. Um, very down to earth and really took an interest in our lives and what we had and what we did. Um, so yeah, really lovely person. So Harry was there as well, yeah? What was he Oh, like? no, he, um, he, he, Harry wasn't <laughs> there, no. he. So the inter, of course, with the, um, obviously with the restrictions at the time, some of the international winners couldn't be in person until later um, in the year. So Prince Harry met with them on Zoom, online, separately, and then we met um, Prince William in person. Well, this is such, I mean, look, the Diana Awards, there's so many different things that the royal family have sort of are behind that uh, offer support. What does it mean to you winning, uh, being awarded this? Um, it was genuinely such an honour to have been awarded because I, when you obviously get involved with this sort of work, you never expect any uh, recognition because that's not the reason you do it. You do it because you're passionate and you really enjoy the work that you do. Um, so actually to have received that was such a shock, but it, I genuinely was so pleased to have been recognised. And I guess having that recognition was only, you know, just an, 